I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. Security cameras at a Florida shopping mall caught a pair of suspected shoplifters recently walking out of a store with $1,478 in stolen goods. One of the women's shirts had the words, Won't Be Caught, printed in block letters on the front. And at last report, they haven't been caught. Be looking for me at McDonald's wearing a I Won't Get Fat t-shirt. An unidentified man in Galveston, Texas, got a big shock last week while walking along the beach when he found 15 pounds of cocaine with an estimated street value of $175,000. Hey, pal, you might want to stay unidentified since somebody's probably looking for that coke. A 31-year-old woman in China suffered kidney failure after squatting 700 times while exercising. She calls it exercising. The rest of the world calls it violating the Geneva Convention. Iran has threatened to fire 80,000 rockets at Tel Aviv. Gee, too bad those rockets aren't strictly for peaceful purposes like Iran's nuclear program. The decade-long marriage of Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner is reportedly on the rocks. Both OK Magazine and the National Enquirer have reported that the pair is headed towards a $150 million divorce. Now, I hope for Ben's sake that this is not true. After seeing Jennifer as Electra and watching the TV show Alias, this is one woman you do not want on your bad side. Police in Sarasota, Florida, arrested a man after a homeowner woke up one recent morning to find him sleeping on her couch. The man allegedly entered the home overnight through an unlocked sliding glass door. When the homeowner woke up and saw the suspect, she woke him up and asked why he was there. The suspect apologized and started pacing around the home, only to leave when the victim said she was calling the police. When cops arrived, the victim discovered that her wallet, license, credit cards, cash, and personal checks were missing. So, next time, maybe call the cops first before waking the crook up? Federal prosecutors have charged former Illinois Republican House Speaker Dennis Hastert with illegally structuring cash withdrawals from bank accounts to conceal payments to someone he committed prior misconduct against and lying to the FBI about it. Wow. An Illinois politician finding themselves on the outs with the law? Well, you know, I, I guess there's a first time for everything. That's your Daily Dose of Weird News. I'm Darren Marlar. Get more weird news at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com.